Hello Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for all your likes, your comments, your shares, and subscribes. I greatly appreciate you Scorpio. So let's tap in to get your ancestral message here, okay? Let's see what your ancestors want you to know right now at this time, okay? Scorpio, 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 Scorpio. So some of my ancestors is wondering, did you get my message? Thoughts. Damn. Family room. Empty. Thief. Ooh. Journey. Mmm. Did somebody try to steal something on somebody's journey? It's like, did you get my message? Somebody named, I'm hearing Eloise. Somebody named could be Eloise. My grandma. My pop, whoever. Yeah, that a cycle is over. Damn, devil. Addictions, obsession, dependency here. Okay, temptation. In this cycle or this cycle is complete. A karmic cycle is over. Did you get my message? Yeah, that's what they want to know. Did you get my message that this karmic cycle is over? Okay, that's what they want you to know. Okay, what they need you to look at right now. Scorpio, 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 Scorpio. Ooh, oh damn, sell out. Sexual art. Okay. Mm. Sell out and sexual art. Okay. I don't, I don't want this. Yeah, sadness. So somebody definitely could have some sort of attachments. It's making them sell. They they like damn. Somebody else has to see somebody as a sellout because they are easily tempted. Yeah, something about sex, man. You could be, uh, your root chakra needs to be aligned. All right, your, your root chakra could be out of whack for some of you guys, male or female. This could be a dude. But I feel like somebody is trying to, uh, something about your solar plexus as well. Somebody's disappointed with the sadness. Yeah, it's time to take off the mask. Somebody's self so sabotaging. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. Help from above. Oh, wow. Hey. Okay. Hmm. All right. Help from above. So, so my ancestors are, hey, trying to come in and help you. Somebody could be working for the lower vibrational energies, okay? All right. Somebody could be Gary. All right. Gary, Larry. Joel. Alright. These could be these are men that's coming through right now. Um hmm. but somebody's being looked at as a sellout eating crow. <sighs> Alright. Um, they're trying to tell somebody that it's a karmic cycle that's over. All right. What's going on? Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Somebody gonna have to start uh, changing their life. They want you to change your lifestyle. Healthy lifestyle. Eating a healthy diet. Get adequate sleep and exercise regularly for optimum health. And prioritize. Focus on your highest priority and I will help you get organized. So whoever I just mentioned was like, I need you to focus on your highest priority. Your life is out of whack, especially your chakras. All right. You have some sort of entity attachment here. Okay. Because you so. I don't want to say whoever. I don't want to say that because that's bad words. But um, it's like somebody could have sold a soul, Loki. Okay, and they have some sort of entity attachment, and it's fucking with their health. I heard oils and boils. Somebody could have boils, oils, lots of toxicity in within them, and there is coming out their skin. Or. Somebody needs to change their diet, okay? Um, whatever this is. All right, Scorpio. Let's see what ancestors want to help you with this. Isis, okay? Libra energy. So we got uh, Isis here. Fertility. And Ganesh, they want to help you move forward past all blockages and obstacles. Okay. So you could have uh, be a part of an Egyptian lineage, um, uh, Indian, Egyptian, Egyptian. Of course, it's Indian energy. So yeah, you have a you're a part of some sort of lineage, but uh, there is a need for you to do change your life around for this. Because it's the ending of a karmic cycle. Somebody's in their thoughts right now because they know a cycle is over. And they sold out. So maybe your life isn't going the way you wanted it. Maybe there's some lack of some sort financially, emotionally. And it's because they need you to change your lifestyle. Okay, Scorpio? Start to, it's time to do things in your highest good here. Isis want to help. Okay. All right. I'm hearing somebody's blocked off to abundance or gifts or something like that. Yeah. Scorpio, what's going on? Yeah, it's time to balance spirituality and practicality here. You are good enough, okay? Adjustments are required, though, right? It's like you are good enough. So, like I said, some esteem issues could be going on with that sacral chakra energy. I'm hearing it's time to be you and you alone. Nobody else but you. Did you sell somebody out here? Because your ancestors is looking at you as a sellout right now. Or did you sell yourself out? Like I said, take it as a resume score. Okay. Thank you, ancestors. I'm, I'm telling them. I'm telling them. All right, yeah. Somebody may want to apologize for something they have done, Squirt, okay? They want to apologize to someone, or this is you, but adjustments are required, yeah. So they about to adjust something here, yeah. You're very close to achieving your goals here. Somebody's very close to achieving your... I'm getting two sets of Scorpios I'm picking up on right now. One is a very close to achieving their goals because they have changed their life over and they prioritize. And ISIS is very, working very closely to them. Somebody else that needs to make... A, whoever the sellout is, that overly sexual or block sacral chakra energy... Um, or just whatever they done sold, they sold to the kind of listen, all right. Um Saturn energy, karma is about to take place here for somebody. And they're in their thoughts here. 
How are we going to do this? Don't let your don't let your past hold you back. Adjustments is required. Yeah, embrace the flow of life, okay? Okay. Somebody is reborn. So somebody has been resurrected here. All right. Yep. Yeah. Breathe through the tension, Scorpio. This is like heavy though. Believing in your good luck. All right. Work through your feelings. And it's time to release negativity. So when, when outcome in the forecast, Libra energy. All right. And don't let your pride hold. Uh, don't let your pride get in the way. Leo energy. Emotions is running high. If there's no communication or something like that. So what happened? Did you was this a part? Okay, what the fuck is going on? All right, let me let me let me meditate on this real quick before I even go any further. All right, Scorpio. Because like I said, I'm pick, it's it's like whatever this is, it's straddled in between. Like I'm hearing two different ancestors, two different people, okay? Speak about this. One person has sold themselves out, sold a dang on energy to the wrong entities, okay? With because of lust, sex, whatever. Somebody else, um, and that's who they need. They could have put somebody in your life, ISIS energy, okay, to help you balance that out. Okay, to help you prioritize, have a healthy lifestyle. You could have met the reincarnation of ISIS. Okay, that's for one Scorpio. Okay, because it was time for a karmic cycle to end. You've been in a karmic cycle for a long ass time. Okay, and for another set of Scorpios, it's like the ones that done sold themselves out here. Okay, it's like you need to prioritize. Isis is waiting for you to prioritize and get in this healthy lifestyle here because you don't realize that you done went too far. Okay, and there's an entity attached to you. And you got to find a way to close this out. And you could be, they could be in their thoughts about you. They're concerned. Emotions is running high. Somebody's, don't let your pride get in the way. Because it's a win-win outcome in somebody's forecast. But they got to release negativity. Okay? Adjustments is required. Somebody's stuck in their south node. When you're supposed to be in your north node. So it's like, it's time to push you forward here. Okay? Somebody, so this is. The two separate energies I'm picking up on, okay? One, somebody is there to help you. The other is like, this is actually in the physical, somebody's there to help you. And the other, this is like energetically. Ancestors are saying, listen, man, I was trying to tell you to do X, Y, and Z here. Like, as you get in my messages, you're not listening. Okay. So that's why somebody all in their feelings right now. Mm -hmm. It's time to heal. Okay. Somebody could be wishing they had confidence to do something. Somebody could be wishing for somebody's confidence, but it's so hard. Something is a burden and struggles. Okay. Yeah. Maybe because something that happened in the past or childhood or something like that. Maybe in the past, somebody took a leap of faith in a new direction and it's hard. All right, what's going on, Scorpio? It's coming towards you. Or you were supposed to take a leap of faith. Death, damn. You came right out. What's coming towards you is an ending. So something is about to change here. When it comes to a partnership, a union, two of cups. How's this coming in? Okay, like I said, so whoever this is, huh, one is a female I'm talking to. The other is a male. There is a female here that's a reincarnation of Isis that is here to help you prioritize, get your life in order, Blah, blah, blah. But there are some entity attachments that you need to let go of when it has to do with over sexual energy or uh, whatever this is. And you have sold your two of cups out. You sold out when it came to that person because of your sexual addictions. OK, and they're like, oh, my gosh, now somebody in their thoughts that this cycle is about to end because they did some fuck shit. You understand? OK, um, others. This is somebody else. Like, oh, my gosh, I'm going back and forth. But <laughs> y'all get it. Y'all going to pick it up. How this coming in? All right. Because they about to end something. They about to change something here. 
All right, no matter what, it's like an ending. They can't, no, that can't be stopped. It's time, it's past time for somebody to have this ending. I can't. Two of Cups. They sold, they sold. I told, didn't I say that? Whoever this dude is, female, whatever, somebody sold these Two of Cups out. They sold them out. They're supposed to be being responsible here, having discipline because you met your Two of Cups. So if you are in a soulmate connection, or if you, I, rather you want to admit it, because this is so, this somebody self-sabotaging is what I'm picking up on. It's like somebody don't want to see they're, they're in the soulmate connection. This is your soulmate, your two of cups, and you sold this person out for sex because of your attachment. Something like that. All right. You are a sellout. So they're trying to <laughs> recalibrate something. Adjustments is required now. Because you're stuck in your south node, which is over some sort of sexually energy. When you need to be responsible. Or you're going to be left out in the cold from the Queen of Pentacles. If you don't find the strength to overcome some sort of addictions that you had in the past, that's actually blocking your pathway. Your self, I told you you're self-sabotaging, man. Self-sabotaging yourself, Five of Swords. Okay? What's the obstacle right now? All right. What's the obstacle, though, now? Having a healthy lifestyle, prioritizing, that's your obstacle? Five of Cups. They feel like they lost this Queen of Swords, lost a Libra, or lost somebody. Yeah, because somebody was waiting. All right. But there was some sort of, maybe somebody waited here, was waiting for lust, or somebody was waiting for opportunity in some way. But somebody, passions or lust got in the way. Now they all in their head, all right, about a stable commitment or uh, whatever this is with their empress. I cannot make it up. So now somebody like, oh, my God. Like, I feel powerless now to having this commitment with my empress. Yeah, the empress could have traveled or moved forward, which brought a tower here. Yeah. Now they feel like that somebody took, whatever action somebody took, somebody's defensive. Like, that, fuck off. Like that? <laughs> like, I don't know. So, if somebody cheated or did some bullshit, it's like somebody like, fuck off. Okay? Because they're not in control of their sexual energy. They sold their damn two of cups out. Strong Scorpio energy is out here, okay? The outcome here is, okay, okay. This is going to be a struggle or challenge, but there's going to be able to harmony here. Bringing something back into balance. You're going to be able to reconcile with this person, all right? But Isis can be like, woo. All right, let me, let me help you out, all right? But don't let your pride get in the way when it comes to communication or something like that. However, this is resonating. Somebody feeling that they got a gut feeling right now. Like, it's the stomach is turning. Like, somebody like, oh, my gosh. <sighs> Breathe, Scorpio. All right. God damn. What's the death card? Something about to change or has to change. Yeah, this juggling, going back and forth. Yeah. You got to do the right thing. Stop juggling about a relationship here. If you should take a leap of faith with somebody or what. What are you juggling? Yeah, King of Cups. It's you juggling. All right. How you should do something. So it's an ending. Something about to change here with this King of Cups juggling here. Okay. Who the, the King of Cups here? Yeah, Four of Pentacles. They could be trying to hold back from doing the work. Oh. Yeah. When it comes to making a solid offer, there is some sort of this. They got they got wishful thinking that this Queen of Cups ain't gonna let you go. Okay. Whoever your counterpart is, they will sacrifice you. They will walk away. They will close out the cycle. And that's just that. But somebody, this King of Cups could be holding back here from doing the work. Mastering themselves. Okay. So you could be the King of Cups. All right, but somebody know that somebody trying to hold back or they held back from doing something or try to control something. Somebody thought they was in control of something. They weren't. What's the four of pentacles here? Yeah, and now they heartbroken, three of swords. <laughs> Can't make it up. Yeah, because they have to do the right thing with the higher with the king of pentacles towards this empress. You gotta do the right thing. It's a thing. Right? To have the empress. What's the two of cups? So somebody could be falling in love with somebody or fell in love, but they sold them out or some shit. Union. What's the Two of Cups? Two of Cups, please, for the Scorpios. How does coming in here? Eight of Wands. Communication here. 
whatever communication happened brought a tower, seven of cups. Yeah. Whatever happened, okay, there we are, queen of cups. To the queen of cups, somebody had wishful thinking, bro. Whoever this, that somebody was not going to lay something to rest and they wasn't going to get their karmic justice, okay? Like, somebody had, whoever the king of cups is, need to understand the cycle is over. They had to change a karmic cycle or end something, right? All right, because somebody definitely in union. Whether they, two of cups working together here with a soulmate, there was some sort of communication, eight of wands, or rapid change that happened, tower moment to a Scorpio. There was some sort of destruction here that maybe somebody had another option. Scorpio energy or had wishful thinking that whoever their soulmate is, their queen of cups, was not going to let them go and heal or lay something completely to rest here. It's karmic justice being served here. Judgment is being called as well. Okay, they pause into review or somebody pause into review about a queen of pentacles. They should have had power and structure and discipline to overcome some sort of drama, conflict here, making a practical decision and moving away from a third party or go towards a union. If that makes sense to somebody. So it's like... This is shocking to them. Somebody sold they damn two of cups out. And they shocked that this motherfucker said, all right, say less. Okay. Archangel Cameo is right here. So this is definitely a twin flame, soulmate, true love, whatever the fuck this is. Okay. Venus energy. Okay. Somebody definitely, uh, this is definitely an empress energy here. Whoever the queen of cups is. King and queen of cups is definitely a two of cups situation. At the end of the day. Somebody had wishful thinking that this Queen of Cups was not going to sacrifice them if they, the shit was out of alignment. If their sexual desires or whatever this is, somebody sold somebody out because of an attachment they had, like whatever this is. Now the obstacle is that they feel like they lost this person. Whoever you are, Scorpio, this is your card. You could feel regret or that you lost somebody for not having a healthy lifestyle, prioritizing, doing the right thing. Could be a masculine Scorpio or a feminine. Take it as it resonates, though. But we got Mars and Venus here. So this is definitely... It's a definite... What you regretting right now? This is the obstacle. Because somebody feel like they lost somebody. What's the five of cups? Yeah. Somebody that was loving, nurturing, and kind. Who the fuck is these three women? Okay, it's like three women here. Okay. <laughs> Who the queen of pentacles here? They feel like they lost somebody that's loving, nurturing, kind, big-hearted. Okay. Who the Queen of Pentacles? Yeah, the cycle ended here. Yeah. Somebody's supposed to close out a cycle here or complete a cycle with a family situation for true love. Like I said, it was time for... Ah, man. I can't. There it is. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. Somebody had to get realistic. This is a twin flame. It's like, what are we doing here? Okay. So, somebody was supposed to close out this cycle with this Earth sign, Taurus Virgo, or Capricorn. What's the world card? Yeah, but they did something in haste that caused them a heavy burden. They didn't listen. So, like I said, they go your ancestors. Did you get my message? Like it was time for you to have a brand new passion to begin in somewhere else. Like with your lover, with a soulmate. Okay, but somebody had to make a choice between two lovers here, but they chose uh some devil energy. All right. Now somebody can be in debt in some way. So now something is a challenge to get a new cycle with somebody now. All right, because they didn't close out so some lessons here. Now they in regret. Like, oh, God. Like, why? I just didn't. You know, we got ISIS here. And under this reconciliation and balance, temperance here. What's this? Temperance, the night of, yep. So taking action here to make some sort of love offer, proposal here. What's this Knight of Cups? Reconciliation, Knight of Cups here, making a love offer, proposal here. What is this Knight of Cups? King of Swords. Yeah, to speak some sort of truth. Something got illuminated. Somebody is definitely like, damn, did I miss this opportunity? Uh, maybe somebody's seeing like, damn, maybe I missed this opportunity to reconcile with somebody here. What's this uh, King of Swords? Well... Because of a choice somebody made. They yeah, or they was gonna miss an opportunity. Yeah, yeah. Taking a leap of faith, eight of pentacles. 
So somebody was in at a crossroads now because the truth is somebody is was is at a crossroads because they got clarity here. Their balance is being restored here or was supposed to be here. They need the structure and discipline here with the Empress or they was going to miss an opportunity. They supposed to take this leap of faith to have victory and success. Ace of Pentacles, Six of Wands, right? Pause to review that. Yeah, they wishing now they can heal something, but somebody could have let them go and they're afraid now. Like, so whoever this is, no matter what sign, the King of Cups, but this is your energy. So you strong, you out here. So whoever your person is, Queen of Cups, okay, they can have water in their chart as well. Okay, masculine, and feminine, however, this is resonating. Somebody's at a crossroads now. They don't know what to do. Because the truth is now they want to make a solid offer and really come into union with this person. But they don't know what to do because somebody is closed off now. They had wishful thinking that this shit was going to backfire in their face. Somebody had wishful thinking, whoever this person is that is in the seven of cups, thinking they can have other options. And this is that in the third. It was a no. That shit blew up in their face. All right, because somebody already communicated about partnership or that somebody already knew that this was their two of cups or something like that. Take it as it resonates. But Archangel Cameo, like, what the fuck? Yeah, yeah. And somebody could have fucked them over. Wh whoever this is that they went towards was they ops. Somebody knew about this true love connection here. All right. Yeah, whoever this low vibrational energy was, they knew that. So temptation. They sold their two of cups out. Yeah, it's your time to enjoy here. P, new love. Somebody was doing some bait magic or something like that. I'm just so yeah. So the ancestors are like, man, what the fuck we gonna do? Saturday, mind games backfiring. Yeah, because somebody chose a karmic woman over their tool of their true love. So whoever the karmic woman is on Tuesday. So somebody like, oh my God, why the fuck would I do that? Friday, Tuesday, between... Tuesday, Saturday, and Friday. Tuesday, Friday, and Saturday could be significant. All right. Oh, first place, middle initial, yours and ears. We got an Aries. Yep, that hex that curse is backfiring on them. They saw the as fuck. An energy vampire. Can't make it up, man. Like I said, whoever this female is, she has some entity attachments, something like that. And I don't know. This shit fucks somebody up. Because now somebody in their thoughts about how I'm going to get a new cycle with my person. Like, fuck. How am I going to do this? <laughs> how am I going to do this? How am I going to do it now? Like, what the fuck? That energy. They at a crossroads now. Because now somebody want to make a solid offer for real. They want to propose something to somebody or... So y'all can reconcile or... So you can reconcile with them. Take it as it resonates. And now somebody like, I don't know, man. <laughs> you feel me? I really don't know about this. Okay. We got I. We got Aries, a sister. 333. Three, three. On the right path, H. U. I miss your cooking. Yeah. Let's see. Message. X. I can't believe I messed this up. Somebody can't believe this shit. Karmic Mel. Somebody tried to put poison in some. I miss you cooking. I put poison or what the fuck is that? I can't get over you at all. What the hell? I tricked you and believing you was the only one. I'm sorry. I feel I'm all in my head and my feelings. Somebody with a Cadillac, uh, Chevy, Mazda, Toyota, Subaru, minivan. Somebody trying to find a way to run into somebody. Because they made a bad choice and they can't stop missing somebody. We got, uh, everybody knew somebody was pressed about somebody at work. Okay, Scorpio, realign your thoughts to a higher perspective. Mm -hmm. Somebody see one and somebody to lose somebody for good. Okay. They want to power over you. So, I feel like once you change your lifestyle and things really start getting in alignment, all right, ice is going to help somebody reconcile with somebody. All right. 
or there will be some sort of growth here. Okay, yeah, why can't I find somebody like you? Take your time, don't need to rush. We got Libra, so somebody like, damn, why can't I find somebody like you, Libra? All right, I don't know, take it as it resonates. All right, yeah, now they about to learn a hard lesson. Scorpio, for whatever they did, yeah, because somebody made the wrong choice about a Virgo, or somebody made the right choice. Take it as it resonates. Yeah, magic backfire times 10. So somebody could have did magic or some bullshit. All right, could have been a Virgo here. Yeah, that was trying to distract somebody. Take it as a resonate show. But somebody like, damn, man. <laughs> All right. Um, I hope that, yeah, so emotions is running, definitely running high, okay? And somebody could be pissed the fuck off right now about this situation. All right. And they trying to run, find a way to run into somebody here. <sighs> That is their person, person, like I said, and it's like, yeah. All right. I hope this helps somebody. All right, moving forward. So my ancestors are like, listen, we're going to have to change your lifestyle. We're going to have to do something in order to get this shit back on track or something like that. I hope this helped. Have a blessed day.